Good evening, viewers uh, from GRCS. We welcome you to this short panel on the NACOP, which is already inching very close. And I have with me in the studio here an officials mm -hmm. from the Department of Youth and Sports. On my right is Pass Warifai, acting director of the Department of Youth and Sports, and Mr. Marcel Mendy, Executive Secretary, National Youth Council. Gentlemen, welcome to this show. You'll be updating us on the state of affairs. Uh, Marcel, let me begin by you. How far have we gone in terms of this year's NACOMF? Yeah, thank you so much, Farmer. Uh, once more, it's a pleasure to be at the GRTS to discuss issues, particularly this time uh, bordering on the NACOMF. I must um, say that we are quite pleased with um, the preparation so far. Um, so far, everything is intact. Um, you know, um, the preparations have been done. and. Um, in fact, everything is set. Even if the NACOM we are to start tomorrow, okay. everything is set. Um, you know, all the playing fields have been done. All the the basketball lawns have been done. All the facilities for accommodation have been set. In fact, right now we are speaking. Somebody is in Bansang to do the final touches on the electrification work. Okay. okay. Uh, the CRR town of Janjambore is playing host to this mega youth convergence. Uh, when are we starting? Um, well, I want I want to say here that. Um, after some consultation with um, stakeholders in youth work and um, concerned um, people as well, um, it has been decided that um, the venue for the NACOMF will be in Bansang instead of Janjangui. Ah, okay. And, um, you know, of course, yet it, um, a date is yet to be decided on, but okay. um, hopefully latest on Monday, Tuesday, okay. um, a date will be announced. I don't want to, you know, say any date here. It may okay. be a bit too early. Okay. But like I said earlier on, latest on Wednesday, um, the date for the forthcoming NACOF will be announced. Okay, uh, as, you have, as you have heard, had it, uh, the date is premature right now to be set, but the venue has been shifted from Janjambre to Bansang. First of all, I understand you are overseeing the marketing aspect of things. Tell us what is happening. Yeah, thank you very much for inviting us. Um, I think so far so good. Um, the NACOF, as Mal uh, said, just tells you that, you know, even tomorrow we can go ahead of it. Okay. The only thing is the date. But so far, so good. The consultation has been going on based on some logistical problems. Okay. You know, that's why. But okay. thanks God that, you know, I just have a call from Bansang that, you know, today they've been, they have a master set up. You know, all the Fuladu people were out to make sure the, 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 the town is clean. <coughs> the venue is definitely taken care of. We, 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 the NECOF organizing committee was in Bansang you know, to look at logistical problems okay. on, b b um, on all the committees concerned. And as marketing, I think so far so good. We have to say a very big thanks to His Excellency al Haji, Dr. A.J. Yeah, Jame, for making this neck of a success already okay. uh, by providing $2.5 million okay. to neck of. Okay. But with all standing, the government to have pledges, $1 million. Okay. And then we have stakeholders like uh, uh, s um, Social Security, who came out and gave out a very good donation. Okay. Jar Oil too came out, and then we are partners in uh, oil, uh, petrol. Okay. He's, he's going to be the supplier of petrol. petrol to take care of the movement. The movement and all those stuff. Okay. And the we what I'm pledging to the Regans is let them continue on their preparation. Okay. Because any time from now, you know, the date will be s uh, signaled to them, and then so okay. that, you know, they will get prepared. Okay. And then we are just telling them, you know, the all the information has been sent to their email boxes and then sent to their sports personnel, youth personnel, okay. so that you know, they can still continue working as a team. Okay. Anytime we set the ball rolling, we go. Even if Christmas is going to meet us okay. in, in, in Bansang, okay. we're going to celebrate it in a grand style. Okay. Yeah. Impressive. Uh, Marcelo, what is the team? Uh, the team for the NACOM um, is actually um, reorientating young people towards um, encouraging them to taking part fully okay. in the socio-economic sector of uh, the Gambia. Okay. And we've realized that um, not many young people um, are taking the lead in that area, and that is why we thought um, we needed to have a theme for the NACOM, which is um, one of the largest convergence of young people, so that we can discuss and get them understand the need for them really okay. to take ownership of that sector of the economy. Okay. Well, aside from that umbrella team, uh, I'm sure there are other series of activities that young people will be engaged in exhibition okay for the first time that we're coming up with exhibition okay and if anybody is an interested what kind of products will be on display any or any any or any type of product okay any type of product based on the individual okay you know young people or young people young people okay. across the board okay. and then you know they welcome they'll be given sub 
at the neck of center. But okay. if you want to market anything apart from that stuff, you can call okay. the neck of secretariat at the independent stadium okay. so that we can discuss. And then we have cultural events, Max Grey dancing, sporting activities will be there, basketball, football, volleyball, athletics, wrestling. All those things will be taken care of on this neck of week. Okay. Marcella, the lineup is too many, but at the end of the day, what do we intend to achieve from this youth convergence? Yeah, thank you so much for that beautiful question. Um, the main thrust of the neck of it's its conference. Okay. And um, at the end of the conference, it is believed, um, we look forward to coming up with resolutions, okay. tenable resolutions for that matter. So that um, some of them will affect young people themselves, some of them will affect um, individual departments or ministries, some of them will affect central government, and um, we hope that um, these resolutions really will be will be achieved, will be worked on, so that um, on our part as young people we do our part, then the others do their part, then together we can succeed, then together we can get um, to what. Um, uh, we've, we've, we've tasked ourselves to. Basically, that's the most important thing. At the end of the day, we will come up with resolutions. Mm -hmm. Also, it is important to note here that the NACOM will serve as um, a point of convergence for young people so that they can come and discuss issues that border on their life. They come make friends here and there. Also, um, it is very important here that I note that um, some of the cultural displays uh, will be will be very new to the young people. Okay. Not necessarily new, but will be very new to the young people, so that they will get to know them, so that they will get to understand their cultures, their traditions. This is quite uh, paramount in the lives of young people because um, you know we've been bombarded with information, we've been bombarded with a lot of things. As such, we we, we fail to know some of our traditions. But with the NACOMF and uh, the cultural displays and all that, we'll get to know some of the past things that our parents and grandparents used to involved in. Okay. Since time is at premium here, can you share with our local audience? 